Well, moving on this afternoon, if you haven't been to Medina in a while, this might be a good weekend to make the trip, especially if your family is into art. Our Lauren Hall shows us about a hit event that is back for round two this year. Heather, this is something that you probably saw on Instagram last year, and it might have given you a little bit of FOMO. 34 artists have taken over the former high school here in Medina and turned each classroom into a different immersive art exhibit. I saw an event uh, in New York City in Brooklyn where um, the works were immersive in nature. People could walk into them and uh, experience them. It was a lot more exciting than just looking at something hanging on a wall. Now Mike Hungerford can say he helped bring a similar style event to his hometown. It's called Playground and it features artists from Buffalo and Rochester as well as Ohio, Illinois and Canada. It really starts really two months before the event when the first artists come in and start setting up. The energy it brings to the neighborhood and to the village is really special. The first time event last year brought about 3,000 people to the school that closed back in 1991. Uh, the village of Medina is like 7,000 people. So economically it means something and I think also too when you're from one of these smaller rural communities there's a sense of thinking you're proud to be a Medinian for a couple days. The public shows this weekend are both Saturday and Sunday. It's $10 for adults to get in and free for kids under 12. Of course, you can find all the details on our website, WGRZ.com. Reporting in Medina, Lauren Hall, Channel 2 News.